Hike 360 here. I'm standing about 100 yards away from the nature center at Veteran Acres Woods. And uh, I'm gonna do a 3.5 mile loop today. We are definitely looking out for a very rare type of wetland. It's called a fen. That'll be the uh, second part of the hike today. Uh, let's see. Camping was good last night. Oh, this is my last hike uh, by myself. My dad is back in town from Switzerland. Uh, he's not here today because he's isolating, you know, because he was on a plane and everything. But next week I'll be with him again. So this is the last one with you and I. This is Wingate Prairie. getting close to the end of my hike here and uh, I'm on the other side of Wingate Prairie now Alright, done with my hike. This was a really neat one. Just perfect temperature for October. Uh, the trails are pretty easy to read, so I didn't get lost. And there are a ton of trails here. Um, good energy from people walking by. Pretty light traffic. Lots of trees, lots of beautiful trees turning colors. Thank you, Fall. Yeah, would recommend. Hello, my friends, my family, and my followers. It's Hike360 here, and I'm here to give you a new hike this week. Except it's actually the second time I've been here. We are at Veteran Acres and Stearns Woods. We're here to do a 3.5 mile hike today. Uh, this is Wingate Prairie, and so I'm going to take you right through. But hey, 
You're not my dad. No, this is Natalie. Natalie is here joining me for this hike. You want to say hello to the people? Hey to the people of YouTube. Hike 360. <laughs> Follow, like, and subscribe. You already know the drill. All right, all right. So let's give you a little uh, view of Wingate Prairie. And uh, yeah, so, you know, we're just cooling today. No big deal. Uh, we're going to stop Slight and... Slight work. Slight work. You already know. And uh, we're going to stop and have some lunch. I'll probably grab a video then too. And uh, yeah, we'll just, you know, it's pretty nice out today. It's a little cloudy, but it's like 60 degrees. It's not raining like the last hike I did at Chicago Botanic Gardens. <laughs> yeah, I had to get my raincoat on, get my, my backpack poncho on. Oh no. That was a whole thing. Light jacket today. Yeah, exactly, exactly. So it's all good. We'll wait till the sun comes out. Mm. Yeah, I remember this being a lot more um, flourished last time. Like everything was way more green, green and, yeah. and tall. Uh, so, you know, it we're. It looks like they do controlled burns around here because the vegetation's like really low. Yeah, for sure, for sure. I've seen a lot of the controlled burns in. Uh, in and around Illinois. I saw that one happening at um, Independence Grove or Elk Grove the other day. Really? Yeah, I saw that one in person. It was so cool. What did that look like? It was just smoke everywhere. Like even in the streets, it was smoky everywhere. And you could see the fire from the streets. Like. Wow. Fire, smoke, you could smell it? Yeah, definitely. And there was like firefighters or whatever around. Firefighters too? Yeah, they were like monitoring. So they had probably like the rangers there yeah, doing it and yeah. then the firefighters too. It was cool. That is cool. And Elk Grove, you told me that there are actual elk. Yes, there are. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna have to do a hike at Elk Grove and uh, give you guys a glimpse of the, the elk that live there. The park district actually cares for them and does all the vet bills and food. Kind of like the buffalo at Buffalo Rock State Park. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Hey, I recognize this sticker. Okay, we'll catch you guys soon.